And what's up, you guys? It's your boy, SF Bay Area Sports Talk. And the Indianapolis Colts have signed former Steelers Pro Bowler fullback Roosevelt Nix. Now, if you're a Colts fan, I think this is a huge signing for you guys. It complements everything that the Colts have done this offseason. As we know, they went out and improved the secondary, adding cornerbacks Xavier Rhodes and TJ Carey. The Colts also improved their defensive line, adding Sheldon Day and all-pro defensive tackle edge rusher DeForest Buckner. And that is just going to be huge, you guys. I think the ceiling is the limit for DeForest. He was phenomenal for us. You guys got a phenomenal player. And of course, they added a quarterback in Phillip Rivers. So that is going to be very exciting to see. I still think Phillip Rivers has a lot of gas left in the tank. He's still got a lot to prove. And now, of course, adding a fullback in Roosevelt Knicks. I think this is going to be absolutely huge. He spent five seasons with the Pittsburgh Steelers, and over there he was primarily used as a fullback, and he did a lot of work on special teams. So I look at him coming to the Colts. I think he is going to be huge at that fullback position. He's going to be providing some big-time blocks on the Colts running game, and they have a very exciting running game. As we know, they have a talented running back, only 24 years old, in Marlon Mack, and he rushed for over a thousand plus rushing yards last year. So, bringing in Knicks, man, he's going to be making those blocks, getting those running lanes open for the Colts running backs, and that is going to be a lot of fun to see. Now, if we look at Roosevelt Knicks, over those five seasons in Pittsburgh, um, his 2019 season, he only played in three games. He was very limited um, due to a knee injury. So hopefully he is all healed up and rested and ready to go this upcoming season. Now injuries ultimately were the reason why Knicks ended up getting released by the Steelers. And that was how he fell to the open market. And that was how, of course, the Colts were able to scoop him up. And now looking at his five career seasons, he played in 60 games. He had 11 career starts and he had 12 catches for 69 yards across that and also one touchdown. So again, like I said earlier, I think with the Colts, he'll be huge at for blocks, but also if the Colts need him to be a receiver to pick up some big time catches, he has that potential and ability. So that will be huge for the Colts. Now, another couple talented running backs on this Colts roster that Knicks ultimately will be providing blocks for are guys by the name of Naheem Hines. He is only 23 years old. And also Jordan Wilkins. He is 25 years old. So man, this is a just amazing threesome at running back you got here. Three young guys that have a ton of potential. And if we're looking at the Colts and what I'm thinking, how they're going to do this upcoming season, again, I like the offseason moves they've made. I think they are going to have a competitive chance to possibly try to get a wild card. As we know, the new NFL Im playoff implications now, you got one extra team in each league now each conference, being able to make it to the playoffs. So we shall see you guys. I think there is a lot to be excited about if you are a Colts fan. And so thank you guys so much for checking out today's video. And if you made it all the way through to the end of this video, then be sure to smash up that thumbs up button and smash that subscriber button and smash that bell button if you have not done so already. If you would like to be notified when brand new NFL breaking news will be coming to you guys live with all the latest happenings in the NFL and we will be covering it for you all right here. And so let me know down in that comment section. I would love to get your thoughts, Indianapolis Colts fans, on the signing of Roosevelt Knicks fullback. I think this is a huge move for you guys. He's going to be providing those big time blocks to open up the running game and create more running lanes for talented running back Marlon Mack. So it is going to be a lot of fun to see. So let me know your guys thoughts and perspectives. And as always, until next time, I'll see you guys again. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.